So actually science chose me. Um, I was trained at UT as an elementary teacher and my very first job I got was sixth grade science. So it was kind of something that chose me, but after I did it for my first year teaching, I was like, I'm hooked. This is what I'm gonna teach. I love everything about this. I tell the kids they're not learning science, they're learning how to critically think and problem solve. So I'm here at West Valley Middle School and this class was studying about genetics and how traits are passed from parents to their offspring. Really innovative uh, way of teaching this. So you have, this is a chart that a lot of people have seen, which is a matrix of dominant and recessive genes on a monster. And then this is the monster that I created using the genes as a map, pretty neat. Uh, so it's, it's really great to see the kids uh, exposed to, uh, to things like this, to subjects like this. Uh, I, I think that's gonna stick more than just opening a textbook up and just reading the words out of the textbook. And I think it's important to have women teaching this because they can show young girls that they can succeed in these highly technical fields. As they go through and think about what type of job they're gonna have one day, I can probably relate any job that they do to the to scientific concept of thinking and reasoning. So I think it's great at this level, especially with the new 865 academies that we've rolled out, they really need to start thinking about pathways and be shown what type of pathways are available. 